E Andy here, a cowboy feels incomplete without his loyal steed, or in our case, his loyal mount. Riding a mount is easy, but capturing it is the real challenge. You need first to settle it. Saddle is a keyword ability introduced in Outlaws of Thunder Junction. It only appears on cars with the mount creature type. Saddle was designed to mirror the common practice of cowboys riding an animal, such as a horse. On Thunder Junction, the range of animals that can be saddled is much wider. Saddle is an activated ability that you can activate as a sorcery. Very important only activate as a sorcery, meaning during your main phase while this deck is empty. Similar to the crew ability, Saddle is activated by tapping any number of creatures you control with total power equal to or greater than the Saddle value N. Creatures with Saddle, unlike vehicles, can attack and block like a regular creature while unsettled, but they have powerful abilities that only trigger when they attack while settled. As the settled ability resolves, the mount becomes settled until end of turn. This doesn't inherently mean nothing, but another ability on the card will somehow refer to the mount being settled. But how do you play settle? Let's build our battlefield and let's put some creatures in play. Asera Paragon a Guardian of Benalia, a Servile, and a Hoplite. Let's put them like that. And I'm going to cast Trained Aryx. Trained Aryx for 1 and 1 white. It's a 3-1. Whenever it attacks, while settled, it gains first strike until end of turn, scry 1. Settle for 2. Any creature type mount is a normal creature spell. Therefore, when casted, it will go on the stack. There can be a counter, there can be a response, Nothing happens and my loyal mount will hit the battlefield. As said, unlike vehicles, a mount is a creature and therefore can attack and defend if able, even without settle. A vehicle, you need to crew it first, a mount not. When my loyal mount is able to attack, I can swing with it without settle or during my main phase, at sorcerer speed, I can tap any creature or creatures with power 2 or greater. Trained Eric Saddle is 2. I can saddle only at sorcery speed. No combat tricks. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to tap my Sera Paragon power 3. It's enough for my trained Eric's. Tap. My trained Eric's is saddled. Because my trained Eric's is saddled, it gets first strike and I can strike whenever it attacks. Some notes. Saddle, as said, is an activated ability that you can activate at sorcery speed only. You can only activate during your main phases and while the stack is empty. You cannot saddle as a combat trick. To settle amount, you need to tap any number of creatures you control with total power equal to or greater than the settle value N. You can tap more creatures than you require. A creature can settle amount if it has summoning sickness because it's not a tap ability of the creature. Unlike vehicles, creatures with settle can attack and block like a regular creature while unsettled. A mount cannot settle himself. Mechanically, mount is to settle as vehicle is to crew, being the subtype that the new mechanic is linked to. There is no real connection between mounts and settle other than a flavorful one. If a mount becomes some other creature type, it will still have settle, and non mounts can gain settle if FX allows them to do so. So, this is how you play Settle. Leave me a comment below. What do you think about this new mechanic? I think it's perfect for Outlaws of Thunder Junction. Subscription button is here. Subscribe for my channel for more and more interesting videos about Magic the Gathering and the Collectible Wet.